from boots, goals and team talks to brushes, canvases and overalls. Ex-Wolves captain Jody Craddock is lacing up his shoes once again, but this time, instead of leading out ten men, he'll be showcasing another one of his talents. A new, a new collection, I've literally been working on it for a whole year. Um, it's not been seen, other than, you know, other than the answer at art, the, the gallery. Um, so, yeah, I took it to show them, they loved it, and uh, so it's a, it's a combination of, of styles uh, of sorts. Uh, I, for years, I'd done portrait, portraiture work, and um, I'd always done the, you know, I'd always painting pictures for the players. So I'd do their kids and or goals that they scored. And when I continued on my career, I, I experimented. I did some photorealism. I did some graffiti. I did a bit of everything. I just wanted to experiment and see what else there was to, you know, what stuff I would enjoy doing. Um, but. The feedback I was getting was, your, your work's really good, but you need your own identity. So a year ago, um, last October, I, I had to sit and think really and, and come up with my own identity. And uh, this work is, a, is, I'd like to say, my own identity. But for Jody, art hasn't just been his passion, but it's also served as his escape. As a footballer, the art was a, a good way of relaxing from the football and trying to forget about the football. You know, if it had been a bad day and we lost the game, to go and paint, I could completely forget about it and uh, just concentrate on what was in front of me. So, you know, it's quite nice and relaxing. Having enjoyed an illustrious career, which included two promotions to the Premier League, it's evident that Jody relives these career highs right from his studio. I could, I could sit in the studio all day and it's that feeling of having, when it's finished, you know, saying I've done that you know I've sat there for two weeks and I've done that I'm really really pleased with the outcome and uh, what I've managed to achieve and the thought of knowing fingers crossed somebody buys it and then they've spent their hard-earned money to hang that picture on their wall. And one person who is accustomed to being surrounded by mountains of art is the gallery's managing director but when she clasped her eyes on Jodie's work even she was taken aback. I didn't know anything about him in terms of, I'm not a football fan, so I didn't understand any of his background. But his work just intrigued me. It was absolutely fascinating. The attention to detail is incredible. Um, it's photorealistic work that I saw then. Um, and we got chatting, as you do, and he was telling me about this idea that he had for a new collection. Um, and when I saw his original ideas, I just thought it's absolutely wonderful, just fantastic artwork fantastic concept, um, just beautiful. He may have hung up his boots for wolves, but with the exhibition just under a month away, it seems as though nothing will stop this Midland sporting idol from pursuing an entirely new career. This is Roshni Patel for The Midland in Cookley.